Alright guys, welcome back to more Heavy Rain. Playing as this guy again, and then let's see what happens. No answer. Baby screaming inside. Not a promising start. We have to go back around this way. Break into the place. This is Balls. A letter on the floor. Maybe I should have a look. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> Wait a minute. Mrs. Bowles? Mrs. Bowles, are you there? I'm busting in, man. Oh, shit. Mrs. Bowles? Mrs. Bowles, can you hear me? Wake up! Wake up! I'm gonna call an ambulance. No, I... I don't want to go to the hospital. Please. Okay. You got something around here I can dress this wound with? Yeah. I think so. Okay. Don't move. I'll be right back. Hmm. Need some bandages and disinfectant. Gotta be here somewhere. Let's see. I need this. And this, and this. I'm here for you, Susie. You'll be all right. I'll take care of you. Oh, I need more. Still bleeding. Stay with me, Susan. Susan, do you hear me? Susan, stay with me. Can you hear me? St Not perfect, but it'll do. Oh, this is the tricky part. There, I done what I can. That should stop the bleeding. Well, luckily, the wounds aren't too deep. Hey. How are you feeling? You okay? My baby. My baby needs me. Right. You stay there. I'll take care of the baby. Okay? Do you know what to do? With a baby, I mean. I'm a private eye. There's nothing I can't do. <laughs> Her name is Emily. Gotcha.
Hi there, Emily. So, what seems to be the problem, huh? Oh! Going by the smell? I got a pretty good idea. Okay. How do you do this again? Well, I'm gonna mess this up. No, oh, brother, that's not the right way. Okay. <clears throat> Let's start again. There you go, fresh new baby. <laughs> that should feel better. Right, Emily? Hmm? Hey, what's the matter? I thought we solved the problem. Maybe she's hungry. I guess I better warm this thing up. Of course. Now I know why you're crying, my little peachy poo. Mother shall be to your rescue. Oh, Emily, are you hungry? Huh? You hold on. I'll just tilt this ball a little bit so you don't choke. Oh, good job, Emily. Hmm? You're feeling good now, right? <laughs> now, I'm gonna rock you very gently so you can have a nice little snooze. Why did we come over here? <laughs> Thanks for looking after my baby. I didn't want to leave her. I just couldn't cope anymore. Just not having Jeremy around. He was such a good boy. I can't understand why anyone would want to hurt him. Do you take care of this baby on your own? Doesn't Jeremy's father live with you anymore? He disappeared. The day after Jeremy. I don't know what happened to him. Maybe... Maybe he couldn't take it. Ever since I've had to look after Emily all on my own and... I couldn't do it anymore. I understand. Did your husband say anything before he disappeared? Did he leave a note or something? 
No. He left the house without a word and... There was just the cell phone. A cell phone? Yeah, I, I found a cell phone in his dresser. I'm sure it wasn't his. I'd never seen it before. I tried to turn it on, but it didn't work. Do you still have it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's in a drawer in the living room. You can have it if you'd like. I'm sure it's of more use to you than to me. Do you have any family or anybody to help you? Yeah, my mother. I didn't want to ask her for anything. We don't really get along. But I guess I'm out of options. Well, look after yourself. And Emily. I will. I promise. I guess she'll clean up the mess. I should go talk to the garage guy over there. Excuse me? Hey! Oh! Ha! Ah, sorry. Didn't see you. Uh, what can I do you for? I'd like to get... My car? Hey, you're well, a pretty patient before. guy, you are. Don't remember. The car's been there for two years. We took it out for a drive every month and check the tires and batteries, just like you said. Here. It's the third Thanks. floor down. The service elevator. Ah, you have yourself a good one, Chief. Hopefully this is the elevator. Because it says elevator above it. <laughs> Dozens of cars. 
But which one am I looking for? Your destination is four miles from here. Leave the parking lot and take the first right. We're just gonna take this car then. <laughs> This is a quick time event, scene, whatever. You have reached your destination. Are you ready to show your courage in order to save your son? Listen carefully. Take the highway and drive against the traffic for five miles. If you haven't reached your destination in five minutes, you will have failed. I can do it. I'd do anything to save my son. If I succeed, I'll get more letters for the hangar. It's my only need. No turning back now. I've got to do it. For Sean's sake. I have no choice.
press the screen. Destination reached. Please press the screen. Destination reached. Please press the screen. Destination reached. Your reward is in the glove compartment. The key is inside the GPS. Your reward is in the glove compartment. The key is inside the GPS. Your reward is in the glove compartment. <sighs> That was kind of difficult. But at least he didn't die. I don't know if he can die there or not. Alright guys, we'll end the video here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.